Good evening, everybody. My name is Jacob Ari LeBenz, and I direct the Gross Center for Holocaust and Genocide Studies at Ramapo College of New Jersey. Please accept my apologies for not attending Dr. Mazur's talk in person, but I'm still within the CDC's suggested quarantine period after a COVID infection. For those of you who may know me or my wife, Meg, we are both well on the mend. Uh, I'd like to take just a brief moment to express how thrilled I am personally and on behalf of the Gross Center to be partnering simultaneously with Temple Emanuel in Kloster and with the Poland Museum for their history of Polish Jews in Warsaw. I'd like to thank Dr. Mazur for initiating this venture in an, and in advance for sharing his knowledge and wisdom with us and for introducing us to the fascinating and vital work of the Pauline Museum. Not long ago, I was part of a panel discussion organized by the Pauline Museum on the theme of Jewish veganism. I'm as proud now as I was then to be working with that illustrious institution. Furthermore, I'd like to extend my deep gratitude to Rabbi David Seth Kirshner, who recently welcomed me back to New Jersey after 27 years of peregrinations and who agreed to host Dr. Mazur's talk. Of course, this evening would not be taking place without Rabbi Gabe Cohen and Julia Vasquez. Thank you both as well, especially for your patience with all of the complications around my COVID infection. I really appreciate you taking the time and making the effort to make this evening a success. Ramapo College has charged the Gross Center under my direction with becoming a valued resource to the regional public. In addition to and entwined with our on-campus work, this includes co- and extracurricular uh, programming, like tonight, course offerings, teacher trainings, study abroad programs, and maintaining a small exhibition space I encourage you to check us out by visiting our website, www.ramapo.edu slash holocaust. Um, now, this charge from the uh, upper administration to be a resource to the community, one which I embrace, means building upon partnerships like these and also responding to the needs of our communities. I hope that you will accept my invitation for further cooperation and to reach out to me as a community or as individuals, should you want to take advantage of our resources. To that end, I'd like to encourage you to sign up to receive events and other announcements from the Growth Center. All I need is your full name and email address. Julia or Rabbi Cohen will be circulating a form we don't email a lot and you may of course unsubscribe at any time. In closing, I would like to mention two major upcoming events. On May 1st, we will be welcoming a Czech memorial scroll to the Gross Center. Originally from the city of Kolin, the scroll survived the Holocaust in the Central Jewish Museum in Prague and was later sold as part of a set of 1,564 scrolls to the Westminster Synagogue in London. The Memorial Scrolls Trust distributes these scrolls on permanent loan bases to synagogues and other institutions around the world. Please reach out as soon as possible if you're interested in joining us as we welcome our scroll and place it on permanent display at the Gross Center. On May 8th, we will be holding our semesterly Holocaust and Genocide Educator Workshop. This program helps teachers, teachers in training and informal educators deepen their knowledge and expand their skills as Holocaust educators. This year's program is called Entering Auschwitz and Approaching Its Artifacts, a virtual tour and discussion. It will feature a live, virtually guided tour of Auschwitz by a scholar and friend with over two decades experience presenting Auschwitz to visitors from around the world. The afternoon will also feature a workshop led by Heather Lutz and Colleen Tambusio, two veteran Holocaust educators, who will help us think about how to teach with artifacts as the Holocaust moves from lived memory into history. 
If you know of anyone who is a professional teacher, teacher in training, or informal educator whom you think may benefit from this program or may be interested in it, please pass on this information to them so that they may sign up in advance. Space is limited. You can find all of this on our website, www.ramapo.edu slash Holocaust. Thank you so much for your time and attention. And I am jealous that you're there to hear Dr. Mazur speak in person. I'm sure that it will be a fascinating and productively challenging evening. Thank you very much.